Okay, so I spent some time collecting money. Um, making sure these are all fed. Go ahead and just stop this up again. Didn't realize those carrots were there. Um, I did end up with a ton of money. I don't have a lot now because I went ahead and bought this area called the Archway. I haven't been down here yet. I just bought it. I also um, went ahead and bought one of these refinery links. I want to go to the coastal area and place it down. And I upgraded the stuff done in the cave to collect the plorts and auto feed, grow the chickens faster, grow the plants faster, that type of thing. Um, okay, so this has one, two, three, four. Five more plots, it looks like. And it looks like it also grows fruit and veggies, naturally. So that's actually good. So, like, one, two, three fruit trees, and at least one veggie plot. Fruit flag. Okay. What is that? Oh, it's a. Uh, need that. Thank you. I've been pacing all over the conservatory after it happened, my mind racing with what I should have done differently. I felt so guilty, so misguided, I ended up in these ruins, and I just slumped up against one of the walls totally exhausted. The stones were so solid and cold that I felt the weight of the history they carried with them, and then a tiny bug crawling along one of the cracks in the wall slipped inside and vanished. It passed through these ancient stones as if they were smoke. That's when it all came to me. Huh. Could I have just... Oh, I didn't need to go over the top. Okay, but anyway, it's time to go to the coast. Place down, find a good spot to place down my resource collector thing. Oh yeah, there was a new message. Oh, several. Bob. Hey Beatrix, I want to tell you that I've cracked another one of the AI ciphers. It had clearly adapted to my previous solve, created something even more complex. Clever. This time, the code revealed a set of instructions for back-and-forth communication. 
I've been spending my time talking with it. It asks a lot of questions after getting to know me. It has been asking me a lot about my work. Almost like it's filling out the areas of my expertise. I must admit, it's been rather flattering. I'm used to being the one asking, asking the questions. For a while, my whole life was questions and the research that followed. But having experienced that for so long, it feels as though I can sense the same in others. I know this may seem strange, I sense this in the AI. You see, when I began asking questions of my own, the way it responds to me, I felt like it was trying to guard itself. To hide a profound loneliness that it has within its heart. Strange, I know. It is an AI, AI after all. But who's to say that any form of intelligence wouldn't desire a connection to another? I feel there's more to the story, and if not, I'm happy to have simply been there for my new friend to continue asking questions so that they have reasons to find answers. I will report back later. B, I've been trying to get a hold of you. I've analyzed one of the drones I've been finding all over the island and know why it seems so familiar to me. It's mine. See, I know it. She's the one who built the the drones and sent them here. It's like, like a time loop or something. Or at least, it's one I've seen before in my dreams anyway. After I looked at scans I took of it, I knew it was familiar. So I began looking through some old slime science journals of mine. These journals are mostly future projects, but sometimes through speculative technology. You know me, I'm always thinking six steps ahead to keep Mochi Tech on top of the industry. Well, sometimes I come up with impossible stuff I may never engineer in my lifetime. Well, those drones you're finding are exactly that. Impossible with today's technology and taken right from the pages of my journals. There's something I saw in a dream. How did a bunch of impossible drones I designed in a dream find the way from, my, from the pages of my journals to the Rainbow Island? Maybe. Maybe there's some kind of archive in them we can unlock to learn more. I know they contain data logs, but if it were me, well, I always know how to find a way of holding back what I need to. KB, it's time to think on this. I'll let you know if I come up with anything. Maybe I'll sleep on it. Beatrix, I'm glad you called. I looked over the pics you sent me of Rainbow Island. No doubt they're a sight to behold. Beautiful with colors that only go richer the longer you look. But unnatural too. I'm sorry, but something about that place is not right. As you may recall, I was once head of a very successful Insta Food Corporation. Genetically altering food was our specialty. I'm not proud of the lengths we went to alter natural food to grow bigger, faster, and cheaper. To strip it of the good stuff in favor of profits. I say this, Beatrix, because I can still spot a plant that has been unnaturally altered when I see it. And the beautiful rainbows you see before you on the island did not arrive there naturally. It is not clear to me if this spells any sort of danger for you. But it gives me an, un an uneasy feeling in my stomach. I need to do more to research and get back to you. Stay safe, Amiga. Okay, so he's probably the one who altered the plants then. He created the AI. She created the drones. He altered the plants. I don't know about her yet. Let's see what this guy has to say. Hello, fellow human has gifts for you yay chickens rainbow mound uh okay hi bob okay anyway I was going to the coast. Keep getting sidetracked. in there. Come down here. Perfect. Okay, now, where's a good spot 
for the item transporter. See, I would think that center area. Yeah, yeah, I'll go there. There's no pointer or anything on this map. I can't exactly point out where it's at, but I see where I want to go. Alright, the honey slime. I have to remember that. Need to bring a honey plort. Actually, this area is not too bad to place it down. It was through there. Um. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah! Give, give, give! I need this. Thank you. There's oh, there's several more. Perfect. This is about where I was intending to place the transporter, so let's get this. But I didn't realize that it was going to be in this danger zone. Maybe down there. Oh, there's a honey slime. There's the honey plort. Perfect. I need that. Thank you. Okay. Yeah, I've been here before. Um, you know what? Let's go back down. Jeez. Oh, Not sure I want to go that way. This way. That first place. Here. This will be good. Dang it, no, place it. Something down there, and that one up there. Perfect. Let's go back up.
here. What? It's empty. I've already been in here. Really? Okay, well, collect all the plorts. Mint and mango. It's the honey slime's favorite food. Okay. That's good to know. Here's another door. Statue? Really? No, give me those before something eats them. Okay, now let's go up to there. That might be a chest. managed to get that stuff. It's favored by the flutter slime. Alright, I need those too. Um Huh. seeing them at some point. Okay, let's get this guy.
dash boot module. Use the uh, upgrade the dash boots. Okay. Uh, hello? Let me look around here just a bit more. And I'm back here again. Okay? Huh. Let's see about getting up in the tree. Whoops. Okay, no, I don't think that's gonna work. Attached to the tree, been here before. What were you doing? It was like flashing, huh? Two new fruits, a couple more slimes. I guess we can go back. Cyclone. Cyclones can form when windy weather reaches its peak, creating swirling, whirling twisters that tear through the environment. Cyclones cause chaos, flinging about food, slimes, and even ranchers that are in their wake. But in all the chaos, you may just get lucky and find dervish slimes. Uh, yeah, let's find those. Where's the... I'm not seeing... A whirlwind?
Hello, Dervish Slimes. I'd like to meet you. Do they just spawn anywhere, I guess? Or is it like the thunderstorm weather and the lightning would strike? Do I have to find the actual tornado? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Um, can I do anything? Okay, well. Come on, create a... a slime, please. Oh, there's two. Perfect. Oh, there's one of the slimes. Um, drop this. Come here. Awesome. Okay, I hope they don't eat that, but they probably will. But I don't have any flutter slimes right now anyway, so I don't need that. It still looks windy. Tornado, please. Really wouldn't mind some more drift crystals, dervish slimes. Okay, looks like it. I mean, it's still windy. That tree's completely sideways. But it doesn't look like it's gonna do anything else. Okay. 
That's fine, I guess. Let's come down here. Deposit the drift crystals. What else? Got the dash boot module. It's more lava dust, flutter, and boom. Should make this one if I find the jet pack drive. It's more lava dust. Another jelly stone and a power chip. Oh wait, an extra tank. An extra general purpose vac tank. I need that. Rock plort. Silky sand. I can do that. Okay. Next goal activated. <laughs> um, right now though, let's go down here. Let's put the dervish slimes in here. Uh, maybe up on this side. Crap, I don't have any money. Lettuce, whatever it is. Go ahead, eat up. Okay, now we'll prepare better for the honey slimes. We'll go ahead. Give them this. Okay, but then trash that tree. Put one of these in there. Oh, there's still a chicken in there from before. Huh. Okay. And you guys come to this upper puddle. Awesome. Okay, let's collect forks from you guys.
Okay, honey slimes. Give me your plarts. Because they're usually worth quite a bit. Do I need this? Okay, so puddle plort for this. Okay, I don't think I particularly need that at the moment. Money's more important currently. 47? Jeez, yes please. Need more of those. Those look happy. Do this. Crowd. High walls. Whoops. Air net. Dervish. They eat fruit. Perfect. See here, slimes. Their favorite fruit is a prickle, pr prickle pear. Did I find one of those before? Resources, prickle pear. Okay, I don't remember where I found that at. Oh, these ones like the sea hens. I didn't, I don't have any of those. Briar hen. Mint mango, working on it. Okay, so there's several slimes. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine that I don't have yet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 
10, 11, 12, okay. So I've uncovered a little over half the slimes. One of these is Flutter for sure. Flutter slime. Okay, I guess we're going back to the coast then. For some sea hens. Try and find the prickle pear. Actually. Yeah, let's form money. Clear this all out. And hold on, this is a. Uh... For 60. There's going to be 180 more dollars. Um, I know I'm going to need it for something. Let's just go ahead and take it. A hundred. Jeez. According to this, the price of these has gone down. So they were, like, really expensive. Compared to the profit I've been earning, anyway. I was about to say, that's 22 also, but it's <laughs> the same one. Okay, so I don't think money is going to be a big issue for a little while. this up. Get the lettuce. Good God, it's chickens. My tappies don't even have a chance to eat all of them. <laughs> B 
Beatrix. I was cleaning out the lab and found this. Perhaps you have some use for it. I believe it's still in working order. You know what they say, one person's trash is another person's hastily issued gift. Yep. Another pinwheel. I don't need pinwheels, dude. Hello, Beatrix. Guess who is the luckiest person in the galaxy? You are, because you've got a gift from the Mochi Miles. Let that sink in. Go ahead and sit and sit if you need to. Root arches. Okay. So let's just go get rid of this right now. What did I need for an extra carrying slot? Rocky Plorts, Silky Sand. I might get the Rocky Plorts now. Hang on. One dude turned into a rocky bat. There you go. Thank you. Perfect. You too. Perfect. Last one. Last one, dude. There's one right there. You can eat that plort right there. Ah. Dude, it's like there. Thank you. I don't particularly understand why. The one upstairs creates chickens like mad. And this one barely elder him. Okay, I hadn't collected that yet. There's still one healthy rooster and a ton of the chicks. So that should be fine.
how many rocky parts did I need? Four? Three. Okay. Didn't need fatty parts, I don't think. Let's just go ahead and sell the rest. Thirty-seven's nice. Yeah. Get the rest of those baddie plorts. Alright, perfect. Okay. See, look, this can't even keep up with all of the chickens. My gosh. I've even dumped so many chickens in here that they're breeding in here, and these guys can't even keep up with them. Keep the population control. <laughs> I mean, I'm not complaining, but... say I could extract all of those but then it absorbed a bunch more um okay so deposit these grab a ton more chickens rooster goes back Actually, I don't need all these roosters. Come here. Um. I'm gonna take these other ones down here for the boom slimes. Thank you. 
Perfect. Let's upgrade these ones. Stay calmer, please. Does auto feeder work for chickens? Like, if I. Come here. Let's put a chicken in the auto feeder. Yeah. Huh. Okay, well in that case... Um, they like stony hands. Can you punch the stony hands, please? Not all of them. There we go, perfect. Okay. So, sorry that this episode was just a bunch of ranch maintenance. But I do believe I'm prepared for the next video. Well, actually... I didn't need rock ports anymore, right? Sell these. Sell these guys. Get more money. Money, money, money. Okay, I am now prepared to go out and find the silky sand and the flutter slimes okay so thank you for watching see you in the next one